Hello, Potato. It may be November, but it is still fall, which I think still puts us in pumpkin spice season. Now, I'm not a big fan of pumpkin spice. I personally believe that pumpkin pie spice belongs in pumpkin pies, and that's really about it. But that's, uh, that's a minority opinion, it seems, because they put pumpkin spice in everything. And normally I just give it a pass. It's just, it's it's not that interesting to me. I did like one year, I had the idea that I was going to do a, a pumpkin spice week and it didn't play out because I didn't find enough items. But this year I found something that I, I found a little too interesting to pass up because it's, uh, it's, it's not just it's a pumpkin spice item. That's the kind of the least of it. It's that it's one of those weird tie-ins between different brands. You know, like, like Doritos potato chips and, uh, well, appropriately... Old Bay Seasoning Goldfish. And I say appropriately because today's item is Goldfish Limited Edition Dunkin' Pumpkin Spice Grams. Because we can't call them Dunkin' Donuts anymore because donuts are unhealthy and coffee apparently isn't. Now, of course, Goldfish could have just made Pumpkin Spice Goldfish without having to, uh, to brand it with the Dunkin' Donuts label. But that's what makes it fun. It's not just Pumpkin Spice. It's specifically, I guess, going to taste like a Dunkin' Donuts pumpkin spice donut. Now, of course, I'll have no way of verifying that because I haven't had a pumpkin spice donut. And frankly, I wouldn't buy one unless it was like, you know, for the channel. But interestingly, though, is it's not in your typical goldfish packaging, like even the Old Bay. Graphically looking like Old Bay, it was still in a traditional goldfish wrapper. This is more like the kind of packaging you see the Dunkin' Donuts coffee in. Pumpkin spice, the kind of flavor you fall for. Goldfish Heart Duncan. Discover more at, gold, at Goldfish Smiles. I'm guessing that is a Twitter handle. I don't know, it could be a could be on their Instagram. I guess now it could even be a, a YouTube channel, couldn't it? It could be at Goldfish Smiles or whatever it is. 140 calories for 52 of them. Well, I mean that that's not a huge amount of goldfish. I mean that's like a you know a big handful. I don't think I'm gonna be eating 52 of them. But let's uh, let's open them up and check them out. Does the package open easily enough? Yeah, it's okay. I was kind of afraid that the foil packaging would just kind of rip. You know, these packages do that sometimes. But, you know, this, uh, I, I shouldn't really be saying until I'm done, but this seems to be opening, well, good enough. Open here. Well, good. I, I wish I'd seen that before. I almost opened it down here. So let's see, what do we have here? I'm guessing we're going to have a... Uh, Goldfish. Yep. They all have smiles now. They didn't have smiles when I was a kid. They were just, just had like smiles on the packaging. See, so yeah, it looks like a little, looks like a goldfish Teddy Graham. Smells strongly of pumpkin spice and graham cracker. And yeah, they have a little smile, little smile on their face so that you can, uh, you can feel like you're eating a living thing. Who doesn't want to do that? All right, so let's uh, grab a couple here and give them a try. So I think the graham cracker part of it's almost more of a texture than a flavor. So yeah, heavily pumpkin spice flavored. Um, that's really about all I can say for it. It's, it's, uh, it's crunchy, it's pumpkin spice flavored. Really, that's about all I can say about it. It's crunchy, it's pumpkin spice flavored. It is... It's unlike a goldfish as far as I'm concerned. Texturally, it makes you think more of like a, like a half of a Teddy Graham. If you remember those, Teddy Grahams, they were little little graham cracker teddy bears instead of goldfish. But uh, these are fine. If you like pumpkin spice stuff, give it a try. If you uh, like graham crackers, maybe give it a try. It, it's not, to me, it's not what a goldfish should be. I'm sure they've done other graham sweet goldfish before. And the, the Duncan logo is clearly just on there to like get your attention, maybe like draw in like Dunkin' Donuts fans to come and try Goldfish. Or I guess because it's limited edition just to buy a bag and keep it on your shelf forever. And I'm not going to mock people who do that. I do have like a 25 year old box of South Park Cheesy Poofs on the shelf with some books off to the, uh, the, the right of the camera. So if you want to have like Dunkin' items on your shelf, I am not judging. But yeah, for me, I'm not, not a big pumpkin spice fan. I could have given these a pass. So I guess the Duncan tie-in really did work because that is kind of the only reason I bought them. But they're okay. If you're, a dump, if you're a pumpkin spice person, give them a try. Otherwise, mm, yeah, I guess 
America runs on Duncan. I don't know. Let's uh, let's try a couple more. Mazda finish ones on the table, right? I guess there is a little graham cracker flavor in there. Just look at the very bottom, but it is predominantly pumpkin spice. I feel like I want to say something more interesting about these. I want to give a more complex description of them, but but there's really not anything else to say. It's uh, it's it's exactly what it says on the package. It's pumpkin spice flavored graham crackers. I mean, that's it's it's just not that interesting unless you like pumpkin spice. Well, despite that, I hope you found this interesting, or at least entertaining. If you did, go ahead, give it a like, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.